Okay team, you know the drill. A bull run opportunity where the market average will turn one grand into 12. And for the biggest brains among us with the ability to wisely choose the right tokens, one grand into a hundred thousand dollars. What are we waiting for? Well, Becker's bat signal to go up in the sky to tell us it's a bull run. And I'm here to tell you that this week we may have just received it. Alex Becker says that he's beginning to accumulate gaming crypto projects. And that's where I know my job, to find out exactly what Alex Becker is buying to avoid those pesky 10x returns and tap into those crypto gaming projects that are going to give you 100x ROIs on your money. If that sounds good to you, hit that like button down below for me, put on your bat hat, let's jump in. So on June 21st, Alex Becker said that he reached into his handbag, pulled out his purse and was ready to start spending on gaming crypto. He of course didn't use those words, but instead he tweeted this, groans, stretches, sighs, walks to computer, unrolls scroll of 100 plus gaming crypto projects, begins accumulating. Sigh. Guess it's time to start preparing for this crap again. And then he followed up with a little bit of justification on why he thinks he wants to accumulate now. He wrote, we could go lower, but I don't see anything less than $18,000. Of course, he's talking about the price of Bitcoin, which he believes is the music to the musical chairs game of crypto, where every other altcoin will follow the lead of Bitcoin. I don't see alts taking any more than another 50%, meaning he thinks these altcoins, including the crypto gaming altcoins, are only going to drop a maximum of 50% of their value from where they currently are. The risk to reward is strong ATM, which is the most meaningful sentence that he's tweeted, inferring that the math is in our favor to buy it now. Because for example, if we invested $1,000 to Sandbox and the maximum it could drop was 50%, according to Becker's thesis, we'd have $500. But the maximum it could run is a 10 or 100X, maybe not Sandbox, but another gaming altcoin, meaning that $1,000 could turn into 10,000. This is called an asymmetric risk to reward ratio. So let's get into the actual good stuff. Which tokens is Alex Becker buying and how much is he buying of them? Well, if you us on this channel you know we have advanced wallet tracking software set up on all of Alex Becker's known and relatively unknown wallets. This is a software available to all of our Patreon members where you can see exactly what gaming crypto project Alex Becker is buying it as he buys it across all the common chains on all decentralized exchanges. But the strangest thing after reading this tweet was I thought I'd see a lot of activity on his wallets. But to my surprise and probably to yours last week he actually didn't accumulate any crypto gaming tokens. And if you'd ask me why, I'd say, very good question. But I do have a little bit of inside information that backs up my theory of exactly what's going on right now with Alex Becker. And based on his last crypto recommendation YouTube video, Becker is likely spending this week doing more research. Because his last video suggested these top 15 crypto games. And if you're relatively big brained, you're going to know that a lot of these projects are actually just outdated. This was the list of crypto gaming tokens that ran in 2021. And Alex Becker seems to have just recycled it for his last video. And this is one of the reasons I think Alex Becker's actually just been doing a bunch of crypto gaming research this week. Not only does he know that this list is slightly outdated, but he's also been heads down working on his new AI company, which he tweeted this about recently. My new startup goes online in about two weeks. Then it's nonstop work slash nightmare difficulty for months. So I'm taking a break for the last few days. And I believe these last few days is his dedicated time to researching crypto gaming projects. And the third piece of evidence that backs this up is this tweet. Got a video covering about 30 of my favorite coins projects in gaming crypto on Saturday with a follow-up AMA chat in the Neo Tokyo Discord. As we we prepare for the incoming gaming run. And if there's something I know about making crypto YouTube videos, there's a lot of last minute research. And these 30 gaming crypto tokens, I don't think he's holding a list of. I think he's going out there right now and finding them for this video. So I actually wanted to apply a historically successful strategy of weeding out the 10x returns from the 100x returns on Alex Becker's latest list of crypto gaming projects. And obviously there's no way to know for sure which of these gaming tokens are going to get you the best returns, but a really awesome way of predicting success in the next bull run is actually compared comparing their performance in the bear market. This really reveals the surface level pump and dump project that really go up for a tiny amount of time and then crash and burn from the legit teams with the legit projects who have put their head down and worked hard over the last 18 months. So we broke down Alex Becker's recommendation list into these top four highest performing tokens based on the ROI you'd get from them within the last month. And at number four on that list is a token you've probably heard of before, D-Race. D-Race is up 21% in the last seven days. And D-Race is the token for the NFT horse racing game that not only Becker spoke very highly of in his last video, but it's probably his overall most referenced project on his entire YouTube channel. We've actually done a lot of coverage on it in the past, including putting out a dedicated video about it. If you wanted to really deep dive, go and watch that. But to summarize, even though it's a relatively simple game, it has a fantastic value cycle, a very impressive bear market of performance and consistency, and a strong roadmap for the future. It also has an impressive tokenomic setup with a huge potential upside if it could hit its previous all-time high. The native token is called Dirk, and the value 
value at the time of recording is 15 cents. Dirt currently has a circulating market cap of $15 million, which is 83%, a great percentage of their fully diluted market cap of 18 million. Now the all-time high of this token in late 2021 was $7.81, which made it get up to a whopping $270 million, roughly a 50X from where we currently sit. Which takes us on to token number three of the highest performing Becker recommendations in the last month. The token is called Network. And if you're not familiar, it's a multi-chain metaverse with tools enabling users to monetize their creations by NFTs and virtual land. It aims to become the next evolution of the internet by offering the world a way to consume and create immersive experiences while monetizing and sharing content that will result in ever expanding virtual metaverse. Beck has been a huge fan of Network for a while, even listing it in his 2023 list of recommendations. So let's have a look at their tokenomics. The native token is called Network and the value at the time of the recording is 14 cents. The token has a circulating market cap of just seven million dollars which is 50 percent of their fully diluted market cap of 14 million dollars the all-time high of the token was seven dollars and five cents which gave it a market cap of 200 million dollars at its all-time peak again roughly a 50x from where we stand now by the way if you wanted access to those alex becker wallet trackers that i mentioned early in this video where you can know exactly when and what alex becker buys when he does it with all these gaming crypto projects including the new ones that he hasn't even talked about yet make sure you join our patreon and now's a really good time to do it because this week we're going through through his 30 recommendations that he's about to put out and we're deep diving each individual one, ranking them against each other to know which ones are the really awesome ones and which ones are more of his state and arena style recommendations. So if you want that competitive edge, meaning you're gonna know when he buys way before he promotes it or talks about it on any of his social channels, the link to the Patreon is in the description below. Get your seat secured now. And that takes us on to token number two, Veracity. Veracity is performing very highly over the last 30 days, even including the panic of the SEC sell-off. It's actually up 20.5% in the last 30 days and up 28% in the last seven days alone. Not only have Veracity creating their own version of Twitch, which rewards not just the streamers, but the watchers of the gaming platform, they're also coming out with a product called AdTech, a product that intends to handle a $600 billion a year industry of reducing ad fraud. And of course, this is why Becker really likes the project because his Web2 business, Heroes, crossed with his interest in Web3, basically leads to a project like Veracity or AdShares. The native token of Veracity is VRA. The token value is just under half a cent at the time of the recording and it has a circulating market cap of 52 million dollars but that's only nine percent of their fully diluted market cap volume so you must be very careful here we're at the mercy of their team because their fully diluted market cap is over half a billion dollars at 567 million the all-time high was 8.6 cents which gave them a circulating market cap of 558 million and the unique number of wallets currently holding the veracity token is 77,000, which takes us on to the final best performing token over the last seven days Altura. And as of writing the script, Altura is actually up 40% in the last seven days and 55% in the last two weeks. Altura is an open Web3 gaming infrastructure platform that combines all the tools developers need to integrate Web3 into their games, selling the shovels to the gold dig. The narrative is really strong and even last time Becker reviewed the protocol, they were just building smart NFT infrastructure, but they've actually had a massive rebrand to so much more. This is actually another token we've covered a lot here on this channel and one that despite not initially loving their technology, they've been working really hard over the bear market. They still have this influencer narrative behind them and hence the amazing performance over the last two weeks. The native token of Altura is ALU and the value of ALU at the time of the recording is four cents. It has a circulating market cap of 28 million, 73% of their fully diluted market cap of 39 million. And this is a long way from their all-time high of 46 cents per token with a circulating market cap of 261 million. The number of unique wallets, players, investors currently holding ALU is 71,000. Now we have a lot more content Content coming out this week on Becker and his gaming tokens as he releases them. We'll be breaking them down here and even further deep diving them in our Patreon. Make sure you don't miss this next bull run. Subscribe, join the Patreon, and I'll see you in the next one.